This smells really good. Wear this around your ops, okay? Because you want some peace. Can I tell the difference? It smells exactly like this. this is a good little situation for this price, okay? <laughs> Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Raven. I'm a fashion stylist and content creator. But on my channel, I do fashion hauls and lookbooks, press on nail reviews, a little bit of DH gate, and I've started to get into fragrances. I love to help women look and feel better, but on a budget. Hashtag baddie on a budget, honey. And this video is no different, okay? I am obsessed with fragrances probably in the last like two years or so. Before that, I don't know what your girl was doing, but she wasn't in her fragrance bag like she is now. So over on the TikToks, this site has had the girls in a frenzy, honey. It is WholesaleBodyOils.com. They literally have everything. And I officially became obsessed. So I saw a video on TikTok where this girl posted a review and haul of her purchase from WholesaleBodyOils.com. And when I tell you... The prices were giving, they were giving. And I was like, wait a minute. I need to go over here and see what they got and get it for myself. And that's what I did. So I'm gonna go over what all products they offer on the shop, what fragrances I got, and also like shipping, customer service, and all of that stuff. Buckle up and get some tea ready because I got a lot of stuff. First things first, this is a wholesale website. So they do have a minimum purchase order even though you do not need a resale license to shop on their site. Minimum order is $50. Before shipping, I spent $51.31. Now y'all, I really wanted this perfume because Raven is not the girl to spend a ton of money on shipping. And this shipping was $17.97. They do come in glass bottles, so it is a heavy package, so I understand why. So expect to pay a pretty penny on the shipping costs. So I placed my order on December 27th. They shipped my order out on January 5th and then it arrived on January 10th. The shipping option that I chose was UPS Ground. It does ship from Florida. So if you live in Florida, Georgia or somewhere else, it's gonna take a lot less time. Now, if you live in California and you pick that ground, it probably won't take five days. It's probably gonna take longer than the five days, but it is shipping from Florida, just so you know. The only hiccup about actually ordering is if you're on the site for any length of time, trying to figure out what perfume you want, you want to order, what body butters, whatever you want to order, your cart will disappear, okay? Because I was waiting for my mom to send me like what perfume she wanted. When I tell you that cart kept disappearing because I was waiting, 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 and I was like, oh, let me add it back and then it would go away and then I add it back and go away again. Frustrated, okay? To say the least. So just know like when you go in there, go on a mission, get in, get out. Because if you try to dilly dally, that cart's going to be gone. And now you're frustrated because you got to go back and add things again because I forgot one of her perfumes. So in our next order, I got to put that in there. So when your package arrives, I've seen people's wrapped in millions of different ways, okay? Mine was wrapped like in paper towels with a rubber band around it. It is what it is. Look, that was a dollar. So I'm just going to go with this is how they packaged it. And then it had a bunch of those packing, what are those things called? The little bubble things it's called it's the popcorn that stuff was in there it's biodegradable which is great i just threw it in my sink but the water it dissolves it was amazing i have seen other people's that it was wrapped in bubble wrap they do add this little thing onto your order and it's basically like who packed your order which i really like it's giving me like lush it says like you can actually request this person to pack your items again for your next order so like Customer service, 10 out of 10. Thank you so much. One of my items was not available. It was like out of stock. I'm hoping that I can get it next time because the TikTok girlies were out here going ham at the wholesalebodygoals.com. So I'm hoping that I can get Ariana Cloud next time because I've heard it smells amazing and I wanted to kind of smell it before I buy it. Heartbroken. But they tell you that it's out of stock. They give you a refund. Don't even have to ask for it. Love it. Automatic. So let's get into what they offer on the website, okay? I got everything written down, so we're going to get into our handy-dandy notebook and let y'all know what they got. They have body oils, 
hand sanitizer, essential oils, super cologne sprays, fragrance oil sprays, air freshener sprays, argan hair and skin care. It's argan oil for those who don't know. Okay. Supplies for wholesale. So they have like bottles, um, like because they have bigger um, containers of the oil. So then you can package it yourself if you want to. So if you want to start that little oil business, go ahead and do it, sis. This is the site for you, okay? They have body spray and powder. They have natural beard and hair care. They have bath and body products, shea butter and body butter. They have massage oils, aroma lamps, and they also have soaps. So they have some of their black soap infused with like the perfumes. Y'all, I am ready. This site is on point okay so next time i order i'm definitely gonna get the butters and i'm gonna get some of this black soap with the fragrance mix stand honey because it's all about layering the scents and we want to smell good all day so for what i ordered these are the prices i ordered mainly the roll on body oils those were a dollar and 69 each they do go up mainly because like for the same size is what i'm saying the label is different. The label that I have on mine is just very basic, generic. You see it, it's just this white label. They have fancier labels because again, this is a wholesale site. So if you want like a fancier label for your shop or if you just wanna be fancy yourself, then get the fancier label. Look, I don't care nothing about that. So we got the basic one, $1.69. The roll-ons actually start at $1.39 and can go all the way up to $4.35, depending on the bottle that you get, okay? The size or the amount of liquid that you get in the bottles range from one-sixth of an ounce to one ounce. I got the one-third, like one-three ounces, one-third ounce, and I feel like it's perfect for like travel, on the go, fit in my purse. You know, I love a little throw in and go kind of situation. So I can use this all day long if necessary. And it's not bulky. It doesn't take up a ton of space in my purse. You really cannot beat it. I'm trying to tell you, okay? Like this is a good little situation for this price, okay? So if you don't want to roll on, they also have these small bottles with like just the opening on them that you can kind of like zap on like this little, little, do all of that kind of situation. And those are, so it starts at one dram and it goes all the way up to one ounce. They start at 95 cents and go up to $3.85. Again, if you want a fancier bottle or a fancier label, it's going to cost more money. Okay, but that's how much it is for the basic label. I also got the cologne spray. Now, I'm over here like, y'all got like a fragrance spray? This is basically perfume. Like what? I got one that I had not tried before. And this is the Kirk Dijon, okay, Aqua Vitae. And I am really obsessed. I'll probably buy more of these. I don't know where they about to fit because over here, is about full okay but the scents that i really really love i do want to get them in this fragrance mist and she is cheap honey do you see like this a lot of liquid this is a lot of liquid in here okay and the cologne spray starts at 3.99 and goes all the way up to 12.60 for the four ounce four ounces that's a lot of liquid y'all like for $12.99 for like this expensive perfume, that's amazing. So this is great for travel. So I'll probably stick with this size of the $4.99. And then for the fragrances that I really, really love, I might get like the bulk ones that I can actually like refill this with. So I don't have to just keep buying this for $3.99 and it'll save me money. Look at that. Let's get into my favorite fragrances from them. Some of these, I do have the actual perfumes in them exactly the same can i tell the difference it smells exactly like it i don't know if they just in the oil or what and how it's getting infused with all the smells i don't know but it's worth it okay first up ysl libre we have talked about her on this channel before and yes i did cop her i got the intense it's a little too intense for me i think i have like a sensitivity to smells now i think i know i have a sensitivity to smells and it's just too strong. It gives me a headache. But my girl Fumi said that if I put it behind my neck, 
okay? It will like go behind me instead of being in front of me and under my nose. So I'm gonna try that. It's a little tip for y'all and for me. So they have YSO Libre. It smells pretty much exactly like the Intense, but just like a lighter version of it. She's amazing. I used her and she is that girl, okay? Smells 10 out of 10, just like it, okay? Number two, Killian Love Don't Be Shy. When I tell you they sent me this perfume, love her down. Again, it's going to give me a headache. I already know, okay? I was feeling it when I sprayed it the first time. I was like, this is, this is very strong and I don't know if I can take this all day. Anyways, I got the roll on because I was like, maybe it'll be a little bit lighter and I can... It's like a touch, not much. It's like a touch lighter, but smells exactly like it. How did you do that? For a dollar and some change. Hmm. Craziness. Moving on. Number three is Le Labo Vanille. When I tell you I got so many compliments on this perfume when I wore her, it smells divine. I wish I could wear her every day. She is that girl. I'm definitely going to get her in that spray. Next time, you will not be able to tell me nothing with the Le Labo Vanille spray on, honey. You can't tell me nothing now with the oil. So the spray <laughs> is about to set it off. Okay, next up. So the Tom Ford Lost Cherry. A friend of mine said that she smelled the Lost Cherry, that it doesn't smell like Lost Cherry. I still love the smell of it. Okay, it smells like cherries in the best way. And she lasted like all night. I had done like a little smell test like right here because I was putting all the perfumes everywhere, honey. So I had put it here in love, in love. It smells so good. It just smells like, like cherries aren't grown in an orchard, are they? A field, like a cherry field. That's what it smelled like. It smelled like a cherry field. And I was here for it, okay? And it lasts so long. So go ahead and cop that. Next up is another Killian. It's an angel chair. The girlies have been talking about Angel Share. And again, Killian, how much is that? But that wholesale body oils and that Angel Share, giving. Okay, I wore her the other day. She smells so good. Like, I see what the girlies are talking about. I see what they're talking about. I might have to give me her. We might have to break it down. But in the meantime, we're going to have two of these. Okay. And lastly is the Aqua Vitae by Kirk Dijon. When I tell you this is about to be my summer scent, honey, it is so good and refreshing. I even sprayed it in my room the other day. I was like, we're just going to spray her around because I need this scent in my life right now because it's still winter here in Texas. Normally, it's like on and off. We would have like a week where it's like 70, 80. It's gotten high of maybe 60, okay? So I haven't been able to bring out any spring anything any summer, anything. It's just been winter, okay? And plus, I've been in the house. But this is perfect, perfect for the summer. I got her in the fragrance mist and I got her in the roll-on. I don't know why I got both because I ain't never smelled this before. But for whatever reason, I decided to get both. Now, the fragrance mist and the roll-ons both come in the same fragrances. So if you want to get both, you can get both because the list is exactly the same. They don't have anything that like, some come in this, some come in that. They don't do that. They want you to pair them together and smell good all day. I guess that's sort of like little MO. Anyways, those are my favorite. Now, the list of perfumes that they have range all the way from like some Victoria's Secret all the way to Bond number nine. Okay, so you can literally get anything that your heart desires. They also have some of the like staples. If you've ever been to like an African store, um, they have some that are called like Obama scent. They have some that are called uh, Michelle Obama. That one smells really good because I bought that from the African store here in Dallas. 10 out of 10 recommend. Um, and then they also have fragrances that are... <laughs> So they also have some that are like a blend of fragrances. I got a few of them to kind of layer on top of some other fragrances. So this one is Apricot Peach and Pear. I don't think I've smelled this one yet. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> that smells like a whole snack, honey. Whole, 
right there. <laughs> Make it happen because she's giving. Oh, this smells nice too. This is a mango mandarin. She smells delicious. Okay, let's just go through these real quick. Who got time? Let's do it. Mine as well. Okay, I did get the Baccarat Rouge. Again, these were all $1.69. This one smells good. I see why y'all be wearing this out, okay? Bond number nine, Scent of Peace. Oh, like, I just feel like it's, like, tranquil. This smells really good. Wear this around your ops, okay? Because you want some peace. This, this smells really good. It's, like, refreshing. Like, it's, it's going to wake you up. This smells good. This Bond number nine, Scent of Peace, get you this, okay? Next up, I did try the new Prada. They have the Prada Paradox. And this one smells good too. It's like light. It's really like, it's just like a sweet kind of fragrance. This smells good. This smells good. 10 out of 10 recommend getting this. Okay, so now the top fours have been hit or miss because I tried the Bitter Peach. My friend also said that that does not smell like the Bitter Peach, like in the store. So these are a little touch and go. Everything else, I feel like it's spot on one. Top four, mm, a little iffy, okay? So we don't know if this is going to smell good. This is all right. Ain't my fave. This this okay. This velvet working. Mm, that's all right. Next up, YSL Black Opium. Heard good things about this. <coughs> I think I got too many fragrances on. That smells good though. Oh, shoot. I kind of put that on my nose. Oh my God. Imagine that. Okay, so this YSL Black Opium, this smells good. I would recommend this. It's not the best. I would say this is like an eight out of 10. It's good though. Okay, so I did get some Victoria's Secret, the very sexy, because I have the very sexy Oasis. Love her down. Um, oh, this smells good. I could definitely lay her with my Oasis. This smells good. I'm gonna give her a nine out of 10. That's, she's a good girl. Like it's $1.69. Like I feel like you could just go into Victoria's Secret because it's not that expensive, but they ain't got no oil. So might as well get this to layer with the inexpensive Victoria's Secret one. But this smells good. Okay, so I got Bond number nine, New York Nights. I tried to research these on TikTok before I got them to see like what people were saying about them. Not all of them, but most of them. Um, Because again, the site is going to delete your whole cart, okay, if you take too long. This smells nice. I just got to roll some out because I just feel like I can't. This smells nice. It's very light, unlike New York. I get why it's New York. This is very unisex. Like, I feel like this could be a men's cologne even, but that smells good. Okay, so I got Creed, because I do have some Creed. Spring flowers. I feel like this is going to give me field frolic, okay? If it's not giving that, then what are you doing? Um, This is ridiculous. I just, like, it smells good. But I don't know if it's giving me the flower smell that I thought it was going to give me. Like, it's giving me, like, I feel like I'm in a, like, a flower shop, which is fine. But I want to feel field. And I'm not getting that fresh air, if that makes sense. Like, I wanted that to be mixed in with this, but it smells good. I don't, we give her, like, a seven and a half out of ten. Killian, good girl, gone bad. This they Killian's big on point, okay? Oh my God, there's just too many areas. I really do like this. It's very light though. It's very light, unlike some of the other ones. But this smells good. I would say this is like 9 out of 10. This is a 9 out of 10. Let's see what the next one is. Creed Adventus. And the reason I'm rolling these on my hand is because like they're just dry on the tip. If you can see, you can see that. So I need to get some of the oil out so I can smell it. No, 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 This is a two. That was gross. We don't just put that over there so it does not go back into the pile. Why is it opium? So I have the black opium and this is regular opium. I need to wash my hands. This smells nice. It does smell, again, like an 80s perfume, but it smells nice. Like, it's not as strong as the other one. Like, when I mean 80s, like, y'all know, know what the 80s smell like, right? Hopefully, early 90s. That's what this is giving to me. So we give her a seven out of 10. 
She all right. That's it. That's all the perfumes that I had. We found some good ones. We know which ones we're never ordering again. Um, some of these that I'll be using sporadically and other ones that I'll be using every single day. Well, clearly not together, but you know what I mean, like more frequently. So that is it, y'all. That is my whole wholesale body oils review and haul. I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions, please leave everything in the comments. So I'll be sure to list and link all of the fragrances in the description box below. And since you've made it this far, you might as well join the tribe of baddies on a budget and hit that subscribe button and that notification bell so you're the first to be notified every time I post a new video. And you might as well follow me on IG and TikTok. But until next time, sis, watch this video that was picked specifically for you.